mostly for Omen. <laughs> What you do with that? According to the map, this is the place, but where's the component? <laughs> you mean this component? Oh, great. Volcanus. I guess I should have known you were around. I spent my whole day plowing through your little pickaxe friends. You should really hire yourself some better minions. They have served their purpose. Now it's just you and me. And this time, you're not going to get away with stealing what is rightfully mine. I only wish you had brought your friend Levin with you. I have a score to settle with him as well. Not exactly. He's probably asleep in his car on the road outside the base. You're welcome to take your best shot at him. Of course, you'll have to deal with me first.
this time, Tennyson. <laughs> Yeah, not that Volcanus was too keen on the idea. Volcanus, yes. He has been meddling quite a lot in our business. He'll have to be dealt with eventually. What do you mean, dealt with? Oh, um, just that the plumbers will have to open a formal case. He seems rather troublesome. That's an understatement. Yes. Well, I'd better put this away for safekeeping. Hey, wait a minute! I'm telling you, that guy is trouble. I don't trust him. He's hiding something. Yeah, I think you're right. Look, I spent my share of time being the bad guy, and you kind of develop a sixth sense about... Wait, wait. You what now? I said I think you're right. I don't trust him either. Well, okay then. If you two actually agree on something, it's gotta be worth checking out. It certainly couldn't hurt to do a little digging. Yeah, but we better wait until we know he'll be distracted for a while. Then Gwen can hack into the computers in this place and find out what it is that Gorvin is hiding. While I was on my way back here, I believe I had a flash of brilliance. A legend in his own mind. Ow! Ah, there it is. It looks like it's in Parkville. That's a town near the mountains north of here. Yes, but I can't pinpoint the exact location. The power signature was particularly hard to find. It must be well hidden and shielded. What's that all about? It's nothing. The plumbers are requesting an account of our progress. Don't let us stop you. Radio's right there. I must report in person. My contact is meeting me shortly at the underground entrance below. I cannot discuss important matters on an unencrypted channel. You should go to Parkville as quickly as possible, all three of you. If you split up and search, you'll have a better chance of finding the object quickly. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay, here's our chance. You two stay here and see what you can find in the computer. I'll take care of this one on my own. Is it? Oh, smelly! I'm a double threat kind of guy! Change into a fast red alien form that could fly. Hit. 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 
If only you could change into a fast red alien form that could fly. Alien soldiers don't need weapons, not with...
knock down to make a bridge? So usually I'd say don't monkey around, but in this case...
duck? Huh. I thought I was... I found the component in a hidden chamber under the fountain at City Hall. It looks like it's being used as a power source for a Xenocyte hatchery. A pretty good one, too. It's freezing in here. According to the plans on file, you're in an unused section of the City Hall sub-basement. I've hacked into their old security system. I'm looking at the room now. You need to shut down all of those power switches on the walls for the hatchery equipment. After you do that, you should be able to remove the component safely. Be careful. Where's Gorvin? Still hanging out with the bats downstairs, I guess. Yeah, and it's a good thing. I haven't gotten anywhere with this computer. Everything's locked out. I did find a file cross-linked to Gorvin's record that looks like it was recorded by Grandpa Max. But even that's password protected. What's the date on the file? Just over five years ago. Why? Hmm. Let me give it a try. I've been at this for hours. What did you type? Flutterworms. Yeah, Grandpa Max considered them a delicacy. Especially live. I totally forgot about those things. He never made you try them. Yeah. Log file continued. Subject, investigation of the plumber, Magister Gorvin. Grandpa Max! Our ongoing investigation has tracked the missing alien tech to Gorvin. But he apparently disposed of or sold the items before we could recover them. Gorvin has also disappeared. At this point, we have no way to know why the tech was stolen or who might have it now. We have issued a galactic rim-wide alert for Gorvin. He is considered to be extremely dangerous and possibly armed. With weapons, that is. If encountered, he is to be placed into custody immediately. End log. Gorvin is a fugitive. Earth is the perfect place to hide since there aren't any full-time plumbers stationed here anymore. And if he's still in the business of stealing alien tech... Then we've been doing his dirty work for him. 
We've got to stop him and find out what he's doing with all this tech. Kevin, why don't you... Where'd he go? Ben, look! He must have used his plumber's badge to open the door. I bet he went to find Gorvin. I better go after him. There's no telling how dangerous Gorvin will be when he finds out we know his secret. Whoa. Kevin? Kevin, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. You're not gonna believe what I found. Gorvin has been hiding tons of alien tech, and it looks like most of it is hybrid stuff. But you haven't found Gorvin? Nah, not yet. But, oh man. There are a ton of Xenocyte eggs down here. This is not good. Eggs? Kevin, just stay put and don't touch anything. Ben is a- Glenn? Hello? Whatever. That four-armed phony is probably bugged out. Not that I couldn't take him myself anyway. You think so? Well, my young meddling friend, I'm sorry to inform you that you aren't worth my time. I usually let my little friends handle the light work. Friends? What friends? Oh, those friends. Right. Well, you guys must have loads to talk about, so I'll just take off now. weapons they can get their hands on. A couple of hits from those blasters can <laughs> Tough situation. Maybe you should just jump.
in a hurry, so usually I'd say don't monkey around. But in this case... better in my life. You know, I forgot how much fun it is to be the bad guy. this again. That is so not fun. 
Oh, my head. What happened? I found you in here. You were antisocial, angry, and had a xenocyte stuck to you. And now I I'm back to normal? Yep. No more xenocyte. Now you're just antisocial and angry. Nice. Well, while you've been messing around in here, Gorvin's getting away. You're welcome. Whoa. You're in no shape to fight. Get back up to the control room when you can and stay with Gwen. I'll track down Gorvin and take care of him myself. Okay, Gorvin. I know you're here. It's time you told us why you lied to us, and what you're doing with that alien tech you tricked us into stealing. <laughs> I'm through talking to you. 
You and your friends have served your purpose. I have what I need, and soon it will be in the hands of my associates. The hybrid? I thought you were smarter than that. As soon as they get what they want, they'll eliminate you along with everyone else. They think we're all inferior beings. That's none of your concern. I'll worry about them. You need to worry about yourself. I'll give you one chance. Leave this place and mind your own business. Otherwise, you'll end up like your unpleasant friend, Kevin. Sorry, no deal. I'll just have to take my chances. Besides, you gotta know by now that I've got a few tricks up my sleeve. Indeed you do. But I know all about your tricks. Your grandfather was no match for me. And neither, I suspect, are you. Come into my parlor. <laughs> Bet you wish you had one of these. Get anything out of the forearm felon? No, but he's out of commission. I found some holding cells below. Guys, I've scanned the whole base. There's no sign of any of the tech that Gorvin tricked us into stealing. At least Gorvin didn't have a chance to give that to the hybrid. Yeah, it's a good thing too. No telling what somebody could do with that if they were up to no good. Um, you guys mind telling me what exactly that is? It's called the sub-energy. It's a subatomic energy source. 
One of the most powerful in the galaxy. An alien race gave one to the plumbers years ago. It was stolen by an ex-plumber named Driscoll. Sounds like the plumbers should have a better employee screening process. We thought that was the only sub-energy on Earth, but this can't be the same one. Ben destroyed that one. Well, wherever it came from, we need to make sure it doesn't get into the bad guy's hands. If you destroyed the last one, you can take care of this one, right? Oh, man. I was just starting to be able to eat spicy foods again. Your interference has forced me to deal with you, Vermin, directly, and obtain this energy source myself. No matter. When we have completed our objective, you and your entire genetically inferior race will no longer be in any position to meddle in the affairs of the hybrid. What did he mean by that? We'd better find out. Gwen, can you track him? Normally there'd be no way to do it, but the sub-energy is so powerful I should be able to find it if it's anywhere within a thousand miles. Got it. Oh no. Look at this. This is a satellite view not far outside Bellwood. A hybrid weather tower. No big deal. We've dealt with those before. Not one like this. Okay. That's bad. If one weather tower can freeze a whole town... An array like this one could freeze the entire coast. Maybe even half the country. We're responsible for this. We let Gorvan trick us into getting those components. And now, it's up to us to destroy that weather array. These paths the hybrids cut through the fields might wreck the environment, but they sure make great roads. Not to mention, they lead right where we need to go. I guess we just drive right up to the weather array and start kicking alien butt. Looks like the butt kicking might start before we get there. Maybe we can throw them off if we split up. You guys head down the road and see if you can find another way through to the array. I'll take care of these guys and continue on foot. Well, this is a team. And I vote we stick together. Two to one. Overruled. Wait just a minute. Yeah, kind of stinks when you're on the losing end of that, huh? I'll make short work of you guys. And I thought you were ugly as wild mutt.
Tall, tan, looks like a lizard. Sound like anybody you know? Looks like not all the aliens are here. These guys are, were, pirates, like people. I'm at the height of my game! ideas about what alien might be useful about now?
We're in a hurry, so usually I'd say don't monkey around. But in this case... We're in a hurry, so usually I'd say don't monkey around. But in this case...
Ben, you're short. Gee, thanks. I mean that you have a that will let you get through tighter spaces than your alien forms can. Think about it. <laughs> Everybody freeze. <laughs> I always wanted to say that. Ben, I'm reading an underground stream directly below. If you can get the Carry shoulders above the rest. <clears throat> Warning, cousin. You have this Omnitrix thing down cold. Nobody wants a monkey out of 
You're getting close? I'm not too far away. But I think I might be able to disable the array from here. How? I found the hybrid command ship, and it looks like it's the focal point of the circuit patterns. Maybe if I can somehow get the ship to take off, it'll break the circuit and shut the whole thing down. You're planning to take on an entire hybrid command ship alone? I'm gonna try. You and Kevin keep going. If this doesn't work, you'll still have to shut down that array. Gwen, I found the entrance to the ship. It's open and there are no guards around. Guess I lucked out. Ben, you sh go inside. Care probably a trap. Gwen, I'm losing you. It must be interference from the ship. Ben, don't go in. Sorry, Gwen, I can't hear you. I'm going in. I'll contact you as soon as I can. Now all I have to do is find the autopilot controls, activate them, and get out before the ship takes off. Piece of cake. to my party. Hot and smelly. Ooh, I'm a double threat kind of guy. Can't stand the heat. Get out of the swamp. switch is connected to the autopilot system. There must be a series of these switches throughout the ship. Be the best flying red alien! 